third map, Warchief Ridge with two match points here. As we mentioned before, it is Echo Isles. And uh, the grand final of the Jera Cup map 3. This is a map uh, match for $100. In the upper left we have Hawk, one of the best uh, European players from Russia. And in the upper right it is Warchief Rich. Maybe uh, next to the Muslim the best player the UK has ever produced. And definitely the best Night Elf player today in Europe. Um, yeah, he did amazing on map 2. Map 1 was super close, so we're expecting a greatness once again in this third encounter. Yeah, and what we see here is like pretty standard, and we see like Echoids quite a lot of times. And like just compared to like the last week, we saw so many games, Human against Night Elf on Echoids, and we have rarely seen the same, I guess. It's like, okay, it's like expansion on the human side, but we have seen Night Elf stuff all over the place. I guess we also had the crazy game with Warden here, or was it another map? I don't know. And um, yeah, I think this is just an interesting map. I think you can, stuff, a lot of stuff can happen here. But Watch If Rich, like you mentioned it to me personally, you said like he's always playing Demon Hunter, and he sticks to that even in that game. Yep, we have the Demon Hunter, we have the Archmage, and we have the greedy mercenary camp spot by uh, Warchief. Probably leading uh, to a kind of fast expansion afterwards and Hawk's building placement points to uh, either a fast expansion or the mercenary creep as well so both players pretty standard high risk in this finals oh we have a subscription thank you Napster Boom! Muddy is coming Muddy is we are getting closer to Muddy with every cast that's really nice Players' forces are under attack, and the viewers appreciate it as well with a sub hype. Okay, mercenary camp creep spot going on. What is Hawk doing? Is he going for the expo or not? This is a yeah, bit... yeah, he's going he for the expansion, getting for uh, militias with him, getting the third footman in production, also building in another farm. Just everything pretty standard, getting this fast expansion there. And on the other side, he, he might try to get the priest, and he got the priest. Oh, but he got so blocked. Good. Such nice reaction time from, from watching there. Oh, but he might be making it out of there. No, he's turning around. The oh. fuck. Yeah, well, at least it's not on the watchship side oh, now. Oh, the engine of war is dropping low, but he's not dying yet. Okay, he's tanking with the DH now. Talisman of evasion. Ah, pretty useless at the moment. Yeah, and the uh, peasants are ready to build the expansion once again. No, don't build it like that, Hawk. Don't. <laughs> don't do it. Whoa, <laughs> nice. he's getting Age of War there to keep him busy. Yeah. Yes, and he's attacking right away. And I guess what we saw last time, he was just expanding right next to where his uh, uh, Ancient of War is right now. And I guess he will be going for the same. Or is he tanking? No, he's not tanking. And there the Tree of Life is. Yep. Yeah, he's playing it safe, he's not committing to this pressure, he's setting up a backup plan at home that yep. he can easily fall back to. And oh, yeah. emulation! Emulation, whoa, nice! I didn't think of that, there's a lot of mana available, so uh, I think the positioning is not yet that great. He has to hit the peasants more, I guess. Okay, now he's in the perfect spot. For that, oh, this is brutal for Hawk once again. Yeah, this just hurts so bad. Even watching this as a human player myself, this just hurts a lot. <laughs> oh, and this footman will also die. Yeah, and the peasant too, I guess. Whoa, well, you cannot escape there, and the tower will also fall. Oh, Hawk. Yeah, this. Uh... Seems to be over. Okay, town portal now. The expansion is halfway through. He needs to uh, creep this first, and then he can apply pressure once again. But yeah, he, he lost several peasants, several footies to that. Look at this, almost level three demon hunter. Yeah, it's just sick. And the thing is, he used emulation with a second skill, right? But he got a talisman of evasion. Yeah, true. This actually means he's level 3, because he got all the three skills that the exactly. demon hunter offers you. It's crazy. 
Didn't Usually you that. don't have the evasion and you take a lot of damage while you use emulation, but if you do it like this, or if you get this item, you're a little bit lucky. But he's just sold it to get boots. And right now, a hawk, this will hurt you a lot. You go for the creep while Warchief approaches your expansion. That's not good news for you. So once again, emulation is on, and with a Berserker, of course, and now a Shadow Priest. Jesus Christ, Hawk is in deep, deep problems here. Level two for the uh, for the mana burn, boots of speed here. At least a good item for him. Not even kidding, this is almost game, I guess. But I hope he can like withstand this pressure. Uh, focusing Demon Hunter there, he even skilled. No, he did not skill e emulation level two. No, it's no. just level one, but it's doing so much damage. And now his Archmage and even the priest is close to all the piercing damage. He could die easily, but he decides to go for the Archmage. It just got a lot of damage, and now the priest will fall super easy. Uh. And Warchief saves his priest. This is just next level Warchief, I guess. Yeah, Warchief is just playing too good here. And Hawk does not really have the answer for it. This, like, this is the main problem. He doesn't really know how to deal with all this kind of stuff. And we've seen it against the top Knight of players that are still remaining, and he did really well against them, yeah. so... So, he was at least able to uh, push out a level 2 water elemental, maybe that helps a little. The Engine of War is ready, the Tree of Life is almost ready, and now Warchief retreats, he takes his time. The tech is almost done, the Huntress Hall is coming, everything is uh, set in line for the big 3-0 win, but never underestimate Hawk. Yes, it's not over yet. We have a slight mistiming on the uh, on the Huntress Hall. He will or he won't be able to produce his Ancient of Lore as fast as he would like to do it. But on the other side, his expansion will be super safe. He cannot really attach it. Hawk has his own problems to worry about. Right now, he's not even able to tag. He's like putting up defenses, I guess, or he should be, because I guess after he finishes but well, after he sets up his expansion, he will just push, 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 get a second hero and just hurt Hawk as bad as you can. So we have Muddy once again. Let's see how long he lasts this time. But uh, yeah, both players are getting the mercenaries quite frequently. That is good. And uh, what's about Hawk's tech did not even start yet? Yeah, Hawk could probably, I've seen it, tower rushing the expansion after expanding yourself. This like sounds like a crazy idea, but if you have like an all-in right now, if you just send like 20 units towards this expansion and you don't fall against the panda, it could actually work, because the Ancient of Laws are kind of late. But I'm not recommending this, this is like next level stuff. No. <laughs> this also gets you killed super fast, so... So but I've seen it succeed. So. Dangerous desperate times and desperate measures, I guess. Yeah, true that. Dangerous situation here for Hawk. He took the big risk to take this creep spot now. Demon Hunter is well aware of this, but he's creeping the Tomb of Experience spot himself. So no time to creep jack right now, I guess. Uh, quick question from the chat, who sponsors the Jera Cup? It's a guy called Jera. Easy answer to that. <laughs> <laughs> Don't ask who sponsors the Out of the Blue Cup. Yeah. <laughs> the town is under siege. Okay, both players got their expansion up. As we mentioned before, uh, Warchief far ahead in tech. But, uh, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Hawk applies That's pressure what's, here. That's what's going to happen now. It's a small window, I guess, since there are no dryads in the field right now. Yeah. And, and the window is closed, I guess. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> but as a human player, it really feels like it. You have timing windows where you can do a lot of damage, and then you have timing windows where you can do nothing. Absolutely nothing. You can just sit back, play it tight, play it safe. Wow, this dryad is... Getting at least one unit, I guess, and the panda is heading towards the shop or maybe towards the goblin shop on top. Uh, I guess he's going for the top spot. 
to get another round of experience to get him closer to level 3 and we also see the Ancient of Wind setting up and as we have seen it before the armor upgrade for the bear sprites yeah. and what's what else is about to come because it's like for most of the units of yeah. the meadow. It's so. pretty ridiculous actually but whatever. Hawk has queued three upgrades as well and he has 1600 gold at the moment. Yeah that's actually good news but he Still has to produce a lot of buildings. And his timing window to hit with this tier, tier 2 army will be really, really close. Marketplace spot now for the Pandon Brewmaster. He will get close to level 3 here. Anything oh, Naga. Sick. Oh, okay. No Mountain King. No. This is actually pretty strange. But What's I really smart is his Demon Hunter is running around the map trying to find the human and annoy him. And while doing this, he keeps one dried with himself to dispel any kind of slow yeah. that could actually get him killed. This is really smart from Broadchief. So Naga got boots. Very important for him. Different upgrade even. For the dryad. Oh, the Shadow Priest is about to fall. He got different? No. He is killing it right now. Oh. And there's this Immolation back, mana burn once again, and now with rejuvenation, no chance to kill the DH off. Is there anything he can kill? Oh, he, was oh, he killed them, both of them. Ah, uh, he killed both of them. And what Hawk was trying there was getting the third healing scroll, but okay. Watchif also succeeded in that. He also got the scroll, as you can yeah. see in his inventory on his Demon Hunter. So this is not looking too good. But at least he has two heal scrolls now. Yeah, that's true. One. And the knight if doesn't really want it because he needs it, it's more like, okay, you don't have it. And he's gotten tons of wisp right now, he's getting like 8 wisp or something like that, getting the second uh, ammo upgrade on his bears. Just great. Watch if he's like preparing perfectly for yeah, what's to come. Everything, exactly. The Maybe the Hawk needs to surprise him at some time, I don't know, really go for tier 3 tech or something like that, and then add griffins, or I don't know. Really needs like anything surprising because what he's doing here is like really expected because everybody is doing it. I'm doing it myself, and I think the Knight Elf just knows what's coming at him. Maybe there's some time for a change. A player's are yeah, I think he won't go for that. The big change was the Naga instead of uh, the Mountain King, and that failed pretty much. At least he tried to push there with, with the Naga, but uh, nothing big accomplished. So yeah, the Demon Hunter is there with a potion of invisibility, but he got... Yeah, cute little move. Yeah, I think it's just to annoy him here. It's more to keep an eye on him, like, okay, I know where you are, I can set... Here, he's setting up for... Ah, he's scouting, exactly. Oh, this is perfect. Why is this mortar hitting the sorceress? <laughs> I don't know. I think he wanted to cut down the trees and the sorceress uh, moved there. He's like, die, woman! Yeah. <laughs> die! Maybe he can steal the item, but he doesn't have a slot yet. Oh, the press of fire hurts so bad. Yeah. Hitting oh, will a he lot steal of it? Oh, he won't. Can you please get the item? Talisman yes. of Evasion. Thank you very much. Tamara Roost coming again. Yeah, and now you, you really you have to hit the timing. Because when the Chimeras yeah. arrive, you're not, you're not prepared for that. Well, Get towers, mm. place towers in the middle and... This will take some time to build the roost and build the first gym, get the money and stuff. But yeah, once one or two are out there, there's no chance for the mortar teams to survive anymore. Warchief is upgrading so fast, it's yeah. so sick. Look at it, he's 1-3 soon. And this beer, uh, bears w won't die, they won't die. Nope. Exactly. What you should do with your mortars is killing the trees below, the, uh, behind the shop, then you can enter it from behind. That's ah, okay. really great. That's what I did in the past. I just reminded myself of it, <laughs> just right now. <laughs> I should do it. It's a good move. So there oh. is no Chim out yet and Hawk is preparing. He's uh, he's going for Ivory Towers, I guess. Yeah, to fall back to. We saw this in several games, the most famous one being uh, Lun vs. Xiao Ti. But yeah, there are Fury Dragons ready. Yeah, and they're just flying in. Nothing to stop them. Well, I think he's in a horrible spot, like right now. Or maybe the spot is even okay for him, but I don't think that he will take the fight. But right now the fight is breaking out. The panda is in, in the first line with the magic potion. 
doing his first breath of fire into the castle did deal quite a lot of damage and right now he's retreating. Hawk is retreating yeah, here. No chance. And that's not what you want to do. No, he wanted the exact opposite of it. To in a perfect world kill the expansion, but uh, we're far away from that. Still two heal scrolls for War Chief, Invu pods, mana pods, he has everything he needs. The tower idea didn't uh, work that well. But now the mortar teams are in a kind of great position to kill everything, but whatever. Naga being chased here. Breath of Fire, Drunken Haze. Great Breath of Fire into the water team. Panda has some problems oh, here. Oh, really nice focus on the Panda here. I know the DH is running low and he has no TP, it's just small little potion. And right now the focus on the Panda is really. He's getting the Panda, maybe. No! The breaker cannot hit cause the dry is slowing his There it is! What breaker is the panda is dead, but the Naga has some problems as well. Demon Hunter put his Invu potion on, and there is two, three what hits anymore. Oh my oh, god, healing. We can kill the DH, maybe. Do it, bro. Invu Invo potion! Invu potion being used. And Use that slow. Use that slow. He got no slow. But the bears. But the bears, yeah. Oh, watch if didn't pay attention to the he bears. He TP and then place himself close to the close to his bears, then he can TP out, but he's not doing it. He's not seeing the opportunity. It On the other side, he's cancelling the tower that has been built by the by the peasants down there. Yeah, but, but he will lose all that beers and also the panda is dead. He lost this four beers. This is a huge opportunity yeah. for Hawk to finish this game. Oh my god, we said it. The game is never over when it's Hawk and Watch even involved. And he just came back with a big smash in the face. Oh, level 5 and a half Demon Hunter though. Yeah, it's, he's well. getting closer and closer to level 6. It's not looking, looking too good, but it's it really is his only possible opportunity to finish this game. He has to kill this expansion right now. Maybe even kill the Moonwit and don't lose your breaker to this town hall. Oh, we did. But the expansion is gone. And that yeah, the means expansion is gone. That's good. Hawk has a huge economy advantage right now. He is on 80 food. The heroes look strong as well. Level 2, uh, level 3 Naga. Super important for that uh, Fork Lightning. The Mortar teams once again in this perfect spot. Can't be hit. The Panda is still not back as it seems. Yeah, not a single Dryad left. All the slow goes through. So strong. But the pan look at the Demon Hunter. He's getting closer and closer to level 6. Yeah, if but these mortars die to the Chimera, he will be level 6. And he's using his invulnerability potion right now. And he will be level 6 if he kills all his Chimera. But he has he's no mana. Your units alive. Oh, it's, it's happening. But he has no but mana to no use mana. it. Oh my god, this is so close. But Hawk is just 75 food versus 50. The only thing that can help him right now is Metamorphosis. Superman! There was a moon with full moon juice. Down there, but he w didn't oh, see it. Oh, he didn't see it. Yeah, now it's gone. Uh, the town is under siege. <sighs> Everything is slowed once again. Let's take a look at the production tab. He uh, is upgrading the tier 3 moon will upgrade right now. Nice, and he's even supply blocked now. And he got yeah. this arcane tower, which is just great. But now we see Metamorphosis Superman is back on the field. Let's Ooh. see what he's ca capable of doing. The panda is back as well. The Breath of Fire was okay, but not much hit. He has to chase the Archmage, I guess. Oh no, he's going for towers and units and stuff. Panda in problems again, blocked by the Wiz. Oh, he should TP out, he should TP out so bad. His breakers are all in the red HPs. Just TP out, let his Metamorphosis run out and then fight again. Yeah. Don't force this, Hawk. Don't force this, go back. Oh, nice oh this breakers will oh, all he's die. losing so what much, the one down. What are you doing? Two down, the third is coming. Oh my god, the bears are getting their revenge. Priest down. This is so much experience. This is so much experience for Warchief right now. Is he able to come back? This would be like a miracle on Echo once again. Yeah, he's doing it. This breakers, look at this! Oh, they want to finish oh. them! Finish them! Oh. Yes, he does! One lasted, two lasted! What a great range! Now Metamorphosis wore off. Two minute That's cooldown. Should have TP'd out. He lost like 20. 20 yeah. Oh, he cancelled the expansion with his peasant into Akintow. <laughs> really nice, and it was not cancelled. He lost all the money. But I guess it's still on still on War Chief to lose this game. Because the expansion of Hawk still got quite some yeah. money. His main base at 2k. But the tower's finished. Like, he got one more tower back there at the natural expansion of War Chief. 
but he has to go there. He has to go there now, and he has to add another round of units. I guess he just bought all the heal scrolls. Yeah, he got two heal scrolls on his demon hunter. I guess you can review uh, the cooldown, right? When the metamorphosis is back again. Yeah, uh, it's uh, s s uh, 70 seconds. Okay. Yeah, this is the timing that he has to hit. He has to do. Oh no, level five panda, panda also. He needs to do, to do such a great job with the breakers now, burning the mana and preventing him from reaching casters oh, and mortar oh, teams. And what he is trying to do is like securing this expansion, and yeah. I don't really think that this will be able. He won't be able to do so because you have like level three breath that does like tons of damage. Yeah. Then you have the demon hunter with the metamorphosis, and you also got chimeras. How will you secure this expansion? Yeah, super boy? hard. Okay, we have one. Two heal scrolls for War Chief. Zero I've seen most temple games with thousand towers and Demon Hunter just crushed. <laughs> yeah. That's true. Where okay. have you been, Hawk? 25 seconds for Metamorphosis. Uh, and of course, he has the mana for it. for it. No masonry upgrade on the towers. Ooh. Just mentioning it because it could be important. And he got no priests, no heal scroll, nothing. He cannot really. And he's bringing more peasants there to repair. And now he's building an expansion there. Oh. What the hell? You're not leading so far, boy. <laughs> well, you were talking about taking risks. And yeah, he does exactly that. Risk. If this goes through, he's in the perfect position, I guess. Uh, what is Starship trying to do? Maybe trying to get some reinforcements there from placing him on the other side. He got three AK towers. They are good against the panda, but they are not really good against the rest of the army. And he got no wood! He got no wood! Oh boy. He's out oh of boy. wood, he cannot produce any units. Metamorphosis coming in. Fort Lightning hit, uh, halving the HP of the bears. They get kinda wrecked right now, but he's retreating now into the towers. This is, of course, the best situation for him. But two chimps in the air dealing yeah. with the mortar teams and stuff. This is looking very good for War Chief, I'd say, at the moment. Oh, he's losing yes. one. But he's losing his chimps and all his units are dropping low. Yeah, the panda has the only zero unit mana. That is superior as the demon hunter. Yeah. He's killing everything, I guess. The panda has zero mana, and he's just standing there in between the towers, doing nothing. Level seven now. Level seven demon hunter. And the panda has level five and a half. The panda is in trouble. The panda is in lots and lots of trouble. Oh, okay, he steps him out okay, okay, okay. just in time. But now all the units that he stepped out before, like the bear that has just arrived here, yeah, got 60 HP ready. left. But this demon hunter is doing tons and tons <laughs> of damage. But he has to go away. Three now. evasion. You don't hit this guy. He just hits back at you. And this arc was yeah. just dropping super low. What oh the hell? Oh boy, hell? slow on the DH now. 170 HP left. Is off. And he wins the game. Nice. Oh, he leaves the game. It's getting hot! <laughs> Hawk is catching up! What it's only 2-2-1 two, two, anymore. Uh, now, whatever. Oh my god. That's These so games sick. are Seriously, so that's close. So sick. These players are really st standing nose to nose to each other. Really? Like, seriously, he was so well prepared after yeah. that early game. How could Hawk come back? Like, big mistake there from that, what? If that one killed. fight where yeah. he lost like four or five bears that broke his neck and he was never able to come back from that. Even with the Demon Hunter Ultimate. Oh boy. We are online for uh, seven hours now. Yeah.